Have you ever considered swimming with a school of hungry piranhas? It might sound like a daredevil's dream or a nightmare, depending on your perspective. But today, we're diving deep into the intriguing world of these notorious aquatic creatures. Piranhas, often portrayed as ferocious predators, are native to South America's freshwater habitats. From the Amazon River to the basins of Paraguay, piranhas have been navigating these waters for millions of years. They are not just survivors, but also masters of their environment. Now let's debunk a common myth. Contrary to popular belief, piranhas are not the relentless killers Hollywood often paints them to be. In fact, they're omnivores, feeding on fish, plants, and insects. They are more scavengers than hunters, preferring to feast on the dead and dying rather than actively pursuing healthy prey. But what happens when they're hungry, when food is scarce? Survival instincts kick in, they can and will resort to aggressive behavior. It's not personal, it's just nature doing its thing. So imagine the scenario. You're in their territory, a stranger in the murky waters. They're hungry, and you're there. It's a risky proposition, no doubt, but it's one that sparks a tantalizing question. Could you swim with hungry piranhas and live to tell the tale? We're not suggesting you pack your bags for a piranha-infested swim just yet. There are risks involved, and they're not to be taken lightly. A piranha's bite, while not usually fatal to humans, can still cause significant injury. They're equipped with razor-sharp teeth and a powerful jaw, tools of the trade for their survival. As we venture further into this captivating exploration, we'll delve into the science behind these creatures, their behavior, and the practicality of an encounter. It's a journey packed with thrilling insights, surprising facts, and a healthy dose of respect for these misunderstood fish. So, are you ready to challenge the myths, face the facts, and dive headfirst into the fascinating world of piranhas? Stick around if you're curious about what it would be like to swim with hungry piranhas. Is it possible to swim with hungry piranhas without becoming their next meal? This question might sound like something straight out of a wild adventure novel, but it's a query that has sparked curiosity for centuries. Are the tales of fearless adventurers swimming amid schools of ravenous piranhas fact or mere fiction? Let's look at some anecdotes. There are numerous accounts of people who claim to have swum with piranhas and lived to tell their tales. Picture this. A sweltering day in the Amazon basin, a local villager steps into a river teeming with piranhas. He splashes around, breaks the surface, and emerges unscathed. Sounds unbelievable, right? Well, it's a story that's been passed down through generations. Then, there are those who have taken the plunge in controlled environments, like aquariums and research facilities. They've swum amongst these infamous creatures, and much to their relief, have not been reduced to a skeleton in seconds. But how can this be? Aren't piranhas the bloodthirsty monsters of the deep we've been led to believe? Well, here's where we delve into the circumstances that might make such an encounter possible. Firstly, piranhas, despite their fearsome reputation, are primarily scavengers. They prefer to feast on dead or dying creatures, rather than actively hunting down healthy lively prey. Secondly, not all piranha species are carnivorous. And those that are, well, they're not always in attack mode. Factors like their feeding cycle, the size of the school, and environmental conditions can greatly influence their behavior. So, while swimming with hungry piranhas might not be the safest pastime, under the right circumstances, it can be possible. But remember, this doesn't mean it's advisable. These are wild creatures with sharp teeth and a notorious reputation for a reason. Let's dive deeper into the science of piranhas in the next scene. What makes piranhas such efficient predators? Piranhas are a marvel of evolutionary design, a perfect blend of physical prowess and predatory instinct. Their streamlined bodies are built for speed, and their razor-sharp teeth can shear through flesh like a hot knife through butter. But it's not just about the hardware, it's the software too. Piranhas exhibit complex hunting behaviors that are both fascinating and terrifying in equal measure. Let's start with the physical attributes. A piranha's mouth is its primary weapon, equipped with a set of triangular teeth that are as sharp as surgical blades. They are set in powerful jaws that can exert tremendous pressure, allowing piranhas to bite with a force up to 30 times their own body weight. This lets them tear off chunks of flesh from their prey with ease. But piranhas are not just solitary hunters, they are pack animals, and their hunting strategy involves teamwork. They hunt in shoals, with each member playing a crucial role. Some piranhas act as scouts, others as attackers, and still others as defenders. This coordinated hunting strategy, combined with their physical capabilities, makes them formidable predators. Now, what about hunger? Does it play a role in their behavior? Absolutely. Piranhas are opportunistic feeders, meaning they eat whenever food is available. 
but when food is scarce, their hunger drives them to become more aggressive, more daring, and more dangerous. It's during these times that they pose the most risk to potential intruders in their territory, including unsuspecting swimmers. It's essential to remember that piranhas are not mindless killing machines. They are complex creatures with intricate behaviors shaped by millions of years of evolution. Their predatory efficiency is not just about their physical attributes or their hunger, but a combination of these factors and more. With this understanding of piranhas, let's explore the practical aspects of swimming with them. What would it take for a human to swim with hungry piranhas? A question that seems outlandish, but as we delve into the practical aspects, the answer becomes fascinatingly complex. Swimming with piranhas isn't as straightforward as jumping into a pool. There are necessary precautions to be taken, ideal conditions to be met, and potential risks to be considered. Firstly, piranhas are more scared of us than we are of them. They are timid creatures, despite their menacing reputation. So the first precaution would be to move as smoothly as possible in the water, avoiding any sudden movements that may startle them and trigger an attack. Next, the conditions. Piranhas are native to the freshwaters of South America, thriving in warm, shallow water. So, if you're planning to take a dip with these fish, you'd want to do so in their natural habitat. And remember, piranhas are most active during the day, particularly at dawn and dusk. As for the risks, while piranhas aren't the man-eating monsters they're often portrayed as, they are still predators with sharp teeth and powerful jaws. A bite from a piranha can be painful and potentially dangerous if not treated promptly. Therefore, it's crucial to be equipped with protective gear and have medical assistance readily available. Diving into expert opinions, most would advise against swimming with piranhas, especially when they're hungry. Despite their timid nature, they can become aggressive when food is scarce or when they feel threatened. The risks, they argue, outweigh the thrill. But let's pose the question to you. Would you dare to swim with piranhas? Would you risk the potential danger for the chance to have a unique adrenaline-fueled experience? In conclusion, while it is technically possible to swim with piranhas, it's a venture fraught with potential dangers and is best left to the professionals or the truly adventurous. And there you have it, the thrilling, slightly terrifying possibility of swimming with hungry piranhas. So would you dare to take the plunge? That, my friends, is the question we've been exploring throughout this thrilling journey. We've delved into the intriguing world of piranhas, those fascinating creatures that have held our imaginations captive for centuries. We've debunked myths, separating fact from fiction, and explored the science behind these enigmatic fish. We've even discussed the practicality of swimming with hungry piranhas, a concept that sends shivers down the spine of the bravest among us. We've learned that piranhas, despite their fearsome reputation, are complex creatures. Their feeding habits, social behavior and survival instincts are a testament to nature's wonder. We've discovered that while tales of piranha-infested waters turning red with blood might be the stuff of folklore, these fish are not to be underestimated. Yes, they are primarily scavengers, yet under certain circumstances they can pose a threat. But it's not just about the fear factor, is it? It's about the thrill of the unknown, the allure of the unexplored. It's about stepping out of our comfort zones and daring to venture into the wild, unpredictable world of nature. It's about challenging our perceptions, pushing our boundaries, and embracing the extraordinary. So, here's where you come in. We invite you to be a part of this captivating journey. Share this video with the bravest souls you know, those who crave adventure, who seek the extraordinary, who dare to take the plunge, Let's spread the knowledge, quench the curiosity, and fuel the spirit of adventure. And while you're at it, why not subscribe to our channel? We promise to bring you more thrilling content, to take you on more exhilarating adventures, to introduce you to more of nature's fascinating creatures. So, buckle up and get ready for the ride. Thank you for joining us on this adventure. Remember to share this video with the bravest souls you know, and stay tuned for more thrilling content on this channel. Until next time, keep exploring the unexplored.